News Theater of the Bluegrass presents James and the Giant Peach starting next week. That's right. So we are joined by, of course, check this out. We have Anna, we have Brett, and we have Caitlin, who are all in the production and going to tell us a little bit more. Okay, so we're excited about this performance. This is one of my childhood favorites of all time, James and the Giant Peach. So if you don't mind, tell us who you all are playing. Go ahead, Anna. Um, I am playing James. Okay. okay. Oh, I love that. That seems like an important role. <laughs> They're right. all important. I'm playing Earthworm. All right. Okay, and awesome. I'm playing the spider. Uh -huh. Aha. Right. So how did you all prepare for these roles? Um, I read the book and watched the movie and kind of just um, thought, like, what would James do for like all these situations? Got to. You got to be the character. You got to think like the character. You got to. Oh yes. Yeah. Of course. Um, I actually had played Earthworm previously to this, so okay. <laughs> I, um, whenever I was asked to audition for Earthworm, I was like, oh, all right. You knew what it. to do. Absolutely. You're the He's back at it. it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> um, I feel like Spider is really just this big sister to James, so I don't know. I feel like a big sister to Anna I now mm -hmm. because like everyone in the cast is so close. Mm -hmm. It was just, I really enjoy being that character. Absolutely. So tell us a little bit about the play. So for some people who've never seen it before, the play or the movie. Um, so it's about this little boy and his parents got eaten by a rhinoceros. Whoa. So he's forced to live with his very mean aunt. But then this strange, mysterious person comes and gives him a bag of magical crocodile tongues and stuff. Okay. And... Well, he accidentally trips and falls, but then it gets on the peach, and the peach grows, and he and James goes inside of it, and he meets his new insect friends and goes on an adventure. That's wow. so cool. Uh, so, so creative and imaginative and, and all the things. Well, we love it, and we're actually watching some video right now, I believe, of you guys practicing and rehearsing, and, you know, it, a lot goes into this. How, what do you guys like the most about it? Um, it would be the people just everyone having fun and talking and like you get to enjoy everyone's company knowing like I'm not here alone I have other people to I can rely on to like I can ask questions yeah. or if I have anything that I need help with they are there. And it's just such a high energy show it's fun to have a place to like get all of that out and to be able to sing and dance and just express yourself however yeah. so is this your field do you all typically do performances have you been doing this for a long time performing yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. how long have you been performing um well i started chorus productions in fourth grade mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. started so. young yeah <laughs> what about you Brad? um i started my first ever whoa first ever <laughs> production whenever i was in sixth grade when i played earthworm Okay. Sweet. And I got started when I was in third grade. So Awesome. Perfect. So tell us when the shows are. Do you all know when the shows are? So the shows are July 13th through the 15th. And then the next weekend, um, the 20th through the 22nd, you can buy tickets online and follow us on Instagram and on Facebook to get more information. Yeah, yes. and it's at Great Crossing High School. Really important to know. We want everyone yes. to make sure they get there and get their tickets. So make sure to check out their website. I don't know. I, I, can you guys like sing sing something for us? Just a little oh. a little blurb of one of my favorite songs. Without I know I put much you away. on the spot. I put you on the spot. Do you mind? Sure. Okay, go ahead. Uh, <laughs> take it away then. What are, you, what are we going for? I don't know. Oh well. <laughs> okay. Well, how about this? I'll ask a final question. We'll okay. wrap it up. Okay. Cool. okay. Yeah. <laughs> Tell me, Anna, how difficult is it to portray James? And you're this beautiful girl. Um, I mean, it's it's definitely hard, but it's you gotta think like it's not just what you're just not playing James. You you're trying to be James. You you have to put yourself in his shoes and like he's living with these horrifying ants. Like this is scary and. I think it's hard, but it's pretty. It's fun, and the funness keeps it bit going. And also, I have my lovely cast and crew. <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah. I love your guys' really. bond. I do. You guys I are all so precious. That. And yeah. Very, very talented to be able to do this. So. Absolutely. Well, thank awesome. you all for coming. We truly appreciate it. We're going to make sure to check you all out. Yeah. Check out James and the Giant Peach because you're going to have so many different performances. And we have an opportunity to see them all, right? Yeah. Yes. Okay. And, and since we couldn't sing the song just now because I put them <laughs> on the spot, go so you can hear the songs that they're going to sing. And support great. them. Yeah. Absolutely. Awesome. Thank Thanks, you, guys. guys. Best of luck to you. Awesome. Thank you.